What's up guys, back with another video. Today I'm going to go over on how to enable crossfire for radon. Now simply, you might think that this is something that's going to be extremely complicated and might have to do extra steps, but it literally only takes one click of a button just to turn on your AMD crossfire. Now the two video cards I have installed into my computer are two RX 480s, which are both overclocked editions. So what we're going to do is that we're going to enable both of them to run on one game. So first off, what we need to do is we need to load up Radon. So how do we do that? Well, first off, we type in Radon, and you see AMD Radon Settings. Make sure you have AMD Radon Settings, and if you need your drivers, go ahead and go to the description bar where you can go ahead and download your drivers. Now first, what we're going to do is we're going to go straight to gaming. But instead, I want you to go ahead and hit the Update button and see whether or not if you have a new version. As you can see, I have a new version of AMD Radon, so it is available for me to download. So if I click it, it's going to disable it, but all you gotta do is click this button. Now, after that, what you need to do is confirm the settings through the game. So we're gonna choose Battlefield 1 for an example test. We're gonna go ahead and go to AMD Crossfire mode and put it to default. Now, it varies between each game. Some games will actually perform better in AFR friendly, optimized one by one, or AFR compatible. It all depends on the game and whether or not if it wants to, uh, if it's designed to run on one of these settings, or not, or actually have it completely disabled. Anyways, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. If you like the subscribe button, I'll see you guys on the next one.